Hey everybody, it's your bro Luke Feast, back at you with another video. Today, I'm going to animate my dog. I'm going to get into the drawing, coloring, and the animation. So stay tuned and I hope you enjoy this video. Hey everybody, what is up? I hope you're having an awesome day. I'm going to be animating my dog. So let's just get into the drawing. I'm going to start with the circle. Like that. So the dog I'm drawing is a chihuahua. I have a video playing right next to me of the chihuahua walking and I'm going to try to replicate it. Maybe like there. So I'm just starting with the eyes. And maybe I can carve the face. So maybe the face can be more jaw-like. Now I'm gonna add the nose right here. And it ends right here, like there's an, yeah, there's a nose right here. Oh, maybe I should make this wider cause the kind of wraps around for the face. Actually, I'm gonna erase this. I'm just gonna do this for now. I think the, I think the jaw needs to be more pointed. So like that. Okay, I think I'm getting somewhere. I can make this pointy. I think I might add a layer for the ears or I might just add them on. Oh yeah, okay, that's look bent. If I make it more narrow, then it looks more doggy. Like, and that, I, I like this actually, how this is turning out. Now I'm gonna add another layer. Oh, I have an idea. I can add a mouth, the mouth moving, so I can add like the lower jaw, like that. And then the teeth, like that. Something like that, I don't know, I'm just making teeth. We got the mouth, so it can be all like, bark, bark, bark. It took some figuring out though. Now I'm gonna draw the body. Like a forward body. Now I'm gonna draw a layer for the legs. That, and then that. The heel goes back here a little more. And then the back legs have a bigger hip, so I'm just gonna go like, there we go. Oh, I'm gonna add the pupils too. I'm just gonna go like big black pupils. I think that's pretty good. Now, I'm gonna get onto the coloring. Now, I'm gonna get on to the coloring. So I'm gonna start coloring the head. Right now, I cannot draw on it, but if I go to Window, Image Trace, I can click on the photo I wanna manipulate. And then I can go to Presets right here. And under Default, go to Black and White Logo, and OK. And then we can go to Object, Expand. And now we can manipulate it. So if we get take the direct selection tool, we can take out the background. I don't like that color, no. What color should I use? I'm gonna start with that. So I'm adding a new brush. If you click the brush icon, I'm gonna add some texture to it like that. So I added some shading right here. Maybe we can add some shading below the eyebrows. Now I think I'm gonna make this color like a lighter gray maybe. Copy and put it into an untitled document and export it. Now I'm gonna make it a PNG, but you gotta make sure it's a PNG. That way it's transparent around. Now, I'm gonna get onto the animation. Now, I'm gonna get onto the animation. I put all the files into this one folder. I'm just gonna drag them in. So I'm gonna start with this audio layer. I got an audio layer of my dog barking. I can drag the audio layer into the project and it will go into the frame. Dog bark sound effect. Yeah. I'm gonna add another layer. And now I'm gonna add the background. And then I'll add another layer for the dog. I think I'm gonna start with the torso and then the legs. If you click W, you get this asset work tool button. You can click the body and it can move the arms. And now this leg. Oh no, they're in front of it. I guess I have to right click and arrange and send to back. I'm gonna add another layer now. Where's the pet? Oh, here it is. What if I go like that? 
So it doesn't look like much until maybe if I arrange, send it back. Now it looks better, see? And we can arrange it like, hey, I'm barking, blah, blah, blah. So I got the mouth closed, but now we can add a keyframe and maybe the mouth opens a little bit. I feel like I want to take out the teeth. Yeah, I'm definitely going to take out the teeth. They don't really fit with what I'm working with. That actually looks a little better. I'm going to go to file. Now it doesn't have teeth. She doesn't have teeth. I think I'm going to make the legs move a little bit. And if you click the onion layer, you can see what's, see the frame behind it and in front of it. So I'm going to zoom into this leg and I'm going to move this like that. And maybe even the pupils move. And then I'm just going to go like keyframe. Now, after drawing it, coloring it, and animating it, this is what I came up with. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching that video. We have animation tutorials, media tutorials, tunes, films, and music. So stay tuned and have a great day. These tunes.